The duty-free shop in Waikiki has reopened after being closed due to the pandemic. Today was the first full day it was open to shoppers. KITV4's Diana Coe was at the grand reopening event and takes us inside. More than 100 brands in beauty, watches, fashion, food and more await eager shoppers. It's gorgeous. There's so many a variety of uh, items and products that I can't wait to check out and hopefully if there's samples. I would definitely would love to sample everything. Ty says she went nuts buying nuts. I went ham on the Kona coffee nuts, the macadamia nuts. I love that and I, I just stocked up a lot. <laughs> like a squirrel. <laughs> the store also supports local. Here you can see some of the 45 local vendors DFS works with. Bath and beauty products aren't the only things they sell. There's also food, fashion, and kids' items. Some 5,000 people pass through these aisles every day, according to DFS. It wants to make sure Hawaii residents know they can shop here, too. Everybody can shop at DFS. You don't need a boarding pass. You don't need a passport. Uh, and we're actually covering the sales tax. Industry groups say they like that DFS's reopening created a lot of jobs. Does it contribute a lot to the economy? Absolutely, at a time that when you need it most. Uh, jobs, jobs, jobs. I saw a lot of familiar faces there. So there's a lot of workers that used to work for DSS that came back, which was nice to see. You don't need to have to be flying anywhere to shop here. DFS says it's providing your passport to a great retail experience. Diana Koki, ITV4 Island News.